tell us a little really, of course, uh, first and foremost, sadly or uh, understandably, and I mean that most sincerely, um, Karen's mother and father have had to go. Um, and we knew that would be the case. I mean, to the fact that Karen's mum in particular, for her own health reasons, you know, to, to, to be here in the first place and to spend the time as she has done is remarkable. Although she's not here for me to say, I said it to her privately as they left the house. And indeed, um, Alan, her father, uh, is, is great. And um, of course, not only that, she has a mum and dad, she has two sisters. So we have Jane and Tracy, and we have Robert, her, her, her brother, and all their families. And I say on behalf of us, a personal thank you to you all for embracing me into your family and to understanding. I know it's been difficult, but understanding the decisions that Karen has taken in her life, and particularly to be with me. And your support of us, uh, you made me really welcome, all of you, in, in your own ways. And, and, and I can't thank you enough for that. Uh, it means a lot to me because, you know, these, in those days, long distance relationships were not easy, were they? And, uh, and that's, that's, that's fantastic. So, my personal thank you um, to you all. Um, and I just want to reassure you, as I'm hopefully you'll feel that and have felt it during the day, that I will want to make her happy for the rest of my life, and I'll do my utmost to make her happy, as I know she is today. And I know a lot of you believe that, and I hope you sense it today, and take that with you, although we're not with you on a regular basis. For my family, 